Welcome to Crimson Tide Connection, where we visit with your favorite coaches and players. I'm joined by head coach of the Alabama soccer team, Todd Bramble. Coach, uh, you head to Vanderbilt and Nashville on Friday night to take on the Commodores. How do you feel like you match up against them? Well, it's just going to be another good, fast Friday night uh, intense soccer game up in Nashville. Uh, they are a much, much improved team. Uh, they you know, have done really well in their first four games. And the, the thing about what we have, to, you know, ahead of us on Friday night is it is their first SEC home game of the year. Mm -hmm. They've started out and played four in a row on the road. So uh, I can't ima imagine the energy level of their team and their fans uh, to s finally see an SEC home game. And uh, we're fortunately, we get to be the ones that uh, <laughs> they get started with uh, at home. So I know uh, there's going to be a lot of energy and uh, intensity and adrenaline you know, flowing at the beginning of that game. So we're going to have to deal with that, certainly. Uh, mm -hmm. And that's not even to mention you know, they're a really good team this year. They've, uh, their goalkeepers had an outstanding year for them so far, and they've got uh, some really good attacking players as well. So it's going to be a great game. That matchup is at 7 p.m. in Nashville there on Friday night. And then on Sunday at 11 a.m., you head to Lexington, Kentucky, to take on the Kentucky Wildcats. Just talk about that team. They've traditionally been a tough matchup, haven't they? Yeah, very much so. That's a noon kickoff in uh, Lexington. And I, I couldn't tell you the series history of what's you know happened with uh, Alabama and Kentucky, but I do know that the last two years they've had our number. Mm -hmm. uh, two years ago we lost uh, to them. You know, after you know leading and controlling the game in the first half up there, they came back and uh, won the game in the second half, and then you know beat us here at home last year. So two years in a row they've had our number. They are off to a great start this year in the league. They've already you know got nine points uh, out of their first two weekends. So they've gotten off to a fast start in non-conference play and in conference play. So. Uh, it's a very good team, and you know, for us, our focus, uh, although we'll have a ton of respect for Kentucky and their players and their coaching staff, our focus for that Sunday game is going to be on ourselves mm -hmm. because we know coming out of the, the last two weekends on Sundays, uh, we haven't played up to our potential. Uh, so really what we have to do uh, more than anything else is focus on ourselves and really make sure that we can get ourselves ready to play on a Sunday. And you know, certainly the challenges you know, are even greater when you go out and play on the road. As you say, uh, as you start on the road, you're, you're about to embark on a four-game road trip. How important are these next four games in determining the SEC? I don't think you could separate um, a four-game stretch. You know, we just have to we just have to really continue to take it one game at a time. This this conference this year now with the addition of Texas A&M and mm -hmm. Missouri, uh, not only the way they've come in, but both of those teams are undefeated in conference play up to this point. So. Uh, the competition from top to bottom uh, is, is very, very intense mm -hmm. this year. So uh, we're not really we, – we know what's ahead of us, but we're right. not looking at a four-game road stretch right now. Right. We're focused on Vanderbilt. Well, Coach, good luck against the Commodores on Friday night. And then on Sunday in Lexington, you take on Kentucky. So Alabama fans, you're in Nashville on Friday night or Lexington uh, on Sunday. I'm sure you'd love to have them come out. Absolutely. All right. Thank you, Coach. Uh, for head coach Todd Bramble, I'm Christopher England for Crimson Tide Connection.